morning. Myself and Kieran are out fishing today. We are back on Secret Lake. Um, he's come down today to try and catch a few carp and after my last trip I'm here to uh, see if I can get a perch out. One of those, uh, see if I can get one of the bigger ones out. Um, I've sat up in the um, same swim that I was in before. Quick flip around the camera. So I've got one rod just behind the tree here and I'm actually float fishing today. So something a little bit different for me. I haven't float fished for a little while. So uh, we'll see how it goes. I'll let you know how we get on a little bit later. Um, yeah, and uh, get back to you soon. The time's about 11 o'clock. Um, I've had one small carp, which will put the pictures up, and one tiny little perch as well. Um, Kieran's had one carp, he's just gone for a little walk round onto the far bank because he's seen a few fish actually feeding on the surface so he's going to go around there and have a go, uh, see what he can do. We'll get some pictures posted up after I've chatted. Um, I'm going to show you what rigs I'm using today in a moment. It's really simple, I'm just using a little, uh, they call it a bobber float I believe, a little bobber float like this guy, like that one there. That's what I'm just float fishing with. Excuse the dirty nails. Um, as I am using some earthworms, so they're quite dirty to use. Blobworms, been using those. They've worked quite well. They worked well in the past when I was fishing before. Same spot, I put one underneath the tree and had some uh, it was cold then, so I thought I'd try the earthworms for the carp, and I actually caught the big perch. So I'm back there with that, and on my right hand rod, which I'm just using, little ledge of weight, small one ounce ledge, one ounce lead, sorry, um, just a small hook tied to a hair rig, um, with about six or seven worms on the hair rig. And we'll, uh, I'll show you those in a moment when I reel in and. Uh, change the bait up on that ledger one but it's just simple free line right well free it's a simple running ledger rig with a little stop um swivel and then i've looped the hair rig onto the um onto the swivel and that's it and very very simple So that's the rig I'm using on the ledger rod. It's just very simple hair rig. It's a little size eight hook. Um, put the worms on the hair and then I loop the other end straight onto the swivel that's on the, uh, tied onto the end of the line. So shall I show you the rig quickly? So literally all it is, running ledger rig with a stop. There's a swivel here and I'll just loop the rig onto that swivel so the lead runs up and down the line nice and freely and then I've pre uh, preloaded my earthworms so straight onto the loop there so don't fall off hold it down slide them down and then you've got your hole at the bottom of your loop pop my hair stop in in like that, just pull it back off, and then I just pull the worms. Can't really see that, but pull the worms down over it, and that's it, all ready to go. He's going just under this tree, just here. That's it. So, time's about half past two. Uh, it's been very quiet for me so far, uh, I've only had that one carp and small perch which was about yay big first thing this morning kieran has had a few fish he's had about five or six carp which he's uh, he's doing really well just using little white pop-ups um i've moved my right hand rod i shall turn the camera around to show you so my right hand rod was underneath the tree i've moved it out now into a little bit more open water just to see if I can pick anything up out there. There has been quite a bit of fish movement on the surface throughout the day, not just carp, there's some smaller fish jumping as well. 
Um, I'm still float fishing down here under the tree. I've not had anything on that at all. Changed the bait up and fed quite frequently down there, but nothing at the moment. So what we'll do is I'll, uh, I shall get back to you if I get anything. If not, we shall speak to you soon. So time's just gone four o'clock. As you can see, the rain started. So I'm sat inside my little uh, bivvy with the window open for now. I'm going to give it another half an hour or so because it's going to start getting dark soon. But it's been an alright day. I've had three little perch on one cart. Kieran's done well. So uh, we'll see you on the next one. But don't forget to go and uh, like all these videos. Subscribe to the channel as well. Also um, check us out. Sussex Fishing Gurus on Facebook and also pop along to Eastbourne Aquarium and Reptile Centre where we've got loads of used tackle that we sell for charity all the uh, all the money's raised goes to the Eastbourne Food Bank so if you ever have anything you want to donate as well give us a shout cheers guys